Good day everyone, Complaining Gamer here. Whether you believe Breath of the Wild is a dead game or not is completely subjective. The Legend of Zelda franchise has proven itself somewhat immortal. The passion and support Zelda games receive is undying and, in my opinion, rightly so. They're timeless, only showing their age through the graphics of each given title's day. Many would say that Ocarina of Time being the pinnacle for the series. Regardless of your personal preference, there will always be longtime fans and new ones finding the universe of Hyrule. Thanks to PC emulation, we can enjoy and manipulate these games in a way certain platforms can't. Breath of the Wild introduced changing weather, which impacted gameplay. Not everyone appreciated this, especially when it rained. LibreVR created a tool which allows us to control many mechanics and items in-game, including time of day and weather through an experimental feature. If you'd like to see the depth to which you can go with this tool, I recommend you watch my God Mode video covering a lot of what it can do. The time of day and weather manipulation will be done using Simu 1.12.2D with Breath of the Wild Editor 2.0.0.9D playing the game version of 1.5.0 with DLC 3.0. Let me show you how it's done. First of all, make sure that you are loaded into your save and open the editor as administrator. So simply right click go to properties, compatibility, and then tick this box here, which says run this program as administrator and say, okay. Now open the editor. And the first thing we're gonna do is click scan memory. Now that's gonna take 30 seconds maybe. During this time, what we can do is make sure that we have the full in-game HUD active. So if you don't, simply go to options, and where it says HUD mode, make sure it's set to normal. Now, the reason you want it to be on normal is so that you can check the time of day and the weather during that time. So right now it's 5.15 p.m. and it's cloudy. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take control of the time of day and you will also watch the weather slider go with that. So we've found everything in the game with the editor. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna test out this experimental feature. So just at the bottom here where it says status and settings, click on testing and you will see this bar. So because it's progressed somewhat along the day, we know that first of all, it's working. So all that we're gonna do is basically drag it around. And if you pay attention to the bottom right corner of the game, it's changing the time of day and the weather. And it literally is that simple. So it starts from 12 a.m. and it goes all the way through a 24 hour cycle, all the way to midnight. And then it will just loop again and again and again. One thing to note is that when you do pick the time of day and weather, for example, if we pick uh, a rainy moment, then it takes a moment for the rain to kick in. And it will also take a moment for it to stop. Uh, the transitions are smooth, they're not sudden and automatic. And there you go, it's literally that simple. Now, you can't exactly separate time of day and weather, they kind of come together and they seem to be fairly randomized, but um, there you go, it's a pretty cool feature which somehow went under the radar forever. So let me know how you get on with that. Remember, this feature is experimental, so potentially expect issues where it may not work. Unfortunately, LibreVR stopped developing the tool quite some time ago, but it does still currently work on the most up-to-date emulator and game versions. My first recommendation if you come across any problems is turn off your graphic packs and try again. You can also reload your save, restart Simu, and restart the editor. If you liked what I showed you, thumbs up. If you didn't, thumbs down. And if you'd like to see more, subscribe.